Pontyland High School first came involved with the programme just before Covid and then we've continued it on into this term as well for a second year. But we've mainly focused the taster sessions around the year seven and eight and then focused the leadership element of the programme on sort of the year nines and tens. A lot of them hadn't done this before so it was brand new to them. It was good to see them sort of try and develop different skills. Cricket is a lot about teamwork and working as a team is better for the future so it will help us. I think outside of school really helped me to build up my confidence on how to do those certain skills. Being able to talk with a team and use the communication skills will probably help easier in the future as well, like working in groups. They know what they've been doing, they've done this all before. They've done the drills, they've done the games and they know how fun it is, how to make it better and it's just so much fun to play. The school has been fantastic in terms of embracing the leadership element. They changed their curriculum to sort of fit us in and make sure that we could hit as many groups as possible. Always active, fun games, engagement and enjoyment, which is really important for the girls to get from it. And then the leadership adds that boat to it as well. The leadership group that we've been developing, that have been doing a lot of scoring at cricket competitions, they were a bit of a godsend last year. And the school were really supportive of competitions which were outside their area. Once you put them in front of a younger audience, they come out of their shell, you can see that their character come out. You realise that helping people means a lot and it makes a difference a lot of times. And just making sure they're all having a good time so if something's wrong, fix it so they're all being involved. You can learn from other people but also help them learn. So ours aren't just your good cricket players, they're the ones who maybe are on the outline of a team sometimes but are good at actually doing the leadership and the engagement so they get the opportunity to actually spend time with other students and build strong key things going forward in life. They've entered all the ECB indoor competitions where they reach the county finals on, on both occasions. Some of the girls are now playing hardball cricket in, in, in PE lessons but also in school fixtures. We just want to show like cricket can be a girls thing too, not only a boys thing, and that we can be just as good. It's been fantastic to see their confidence develop from what we've done in the school to then go and lead on at one of their local cricket clubs. I really like to be a young leader one day because I want to help people and inspire them to find the sport they love and help them feel comfortable with playing as well.